There's been a ton of talk about MCPs all over the internet, recent announcements from Microsoft to Google. I had to jump on and show you a really quick use case that I found to be extremely powerful. So here's the context. I put out this tweet yesterday. It said, what's the most underrated marketing and growth channel right now? You can see it right here. It's literally one sentence, but a ton of people saw this and interacted with it. In fact, it's got over 80,000 views, uh, 600 bookmarks, and I really just don't have the time to go through and read every single one of these replies. I wanna get some data, I wanna get information, I wanna understand what marketing channel I should attack next, and maybe I wanna know the best approach and how I can do it. So this is true leverage right here. I'm using distribution to get ideas from the crowd and then I'm gonna feed that in to Claude with MCP and I'm gonna do it live right here and we're gonna see exactly what happens. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up Claude. All I have is my tweet URL and I'm saying fetch me the replies for the tweet with the author name, tweet text, et cetera. It's actually a pretty broad prompt. I'm gonna enter it and we're gonna see if it works. Okay, so you can see that what is happening, Claude is accessing a tool from N8N that is scraping the replies and the data from this particular tweet. So my uh, MCP integration is working as expected. You can't do this out of the gate and it's sort of hard to scrape X. So I, I used Appify. Uh, what it's doing is it's fetching all the data from this URL. And uh, again, MCP, the way I think about it, it's kind of like a two-way radio between AI and a piece of software. You can uh, collect data, you can send back data in commands, and you can do it all from natural language uh, via prompting uh, right here inside Claude. So it's working, I think. Let's uh, have a look. All right, top replies by likes. We've got... My friend Justin Brook, it says, Google Ads can't beat intent-based advertising. It's wild to me that it's not even mentioned once in all these comments. People are asleep at the wheel. Justin, I have to say, I think you're right. Google Ads is definitely underrated, excuse me, underrated right now. Let's go back and just make sure that this is not hallucinating and this is using real data from X. Okay, so is Justin Brooke the top reply in the tweet? Yes, he is. It's got the exact uh, metrics and it has the exact same reply. So let's keep going. Uh, we've got Tadas with TikTok influencers, uh, mail and IRL events, uh, Adam Singer, what's up? Eight likes, I would say OOH, uh, out of home but we keep posting new annual time highs. So it's got all of these uh, replies. It's got other notable replies and it has interesting outliers, ones that you know didn't necessarily uh, get a lot of likes, but were kind of cool. So um, how would I use this? Uh, let's see, um, summarize the most common answers. So maybe somebody had a reply um, and uh, they didn't get a lot of likes, but let's, let's go through here. Uh, TikTok, multiple mentions highlighting both organic content and influencer marketing, direct and physical mail. You know, I see a lot of large direct to consumer uh, e-com companies using direct mail. Um, I believe the founder of Ferme uh, mentioned that Ramp does this very successfully. We've got Reddit. IRL events, LinkedIn, uh, Google ads, word of mouth, et cetera. So my business is um, boringmarketing.com where I do AI automations for clients. Which channel makes the most sense for me? So you can just sort of see how you can interact uh, with real data to get extremely tailored recommendations here. So um, it's ranking uh, some of these channels for me. Uh, LinkedIn and Google ads are the top. It's even referencing um, you know, the, the replies 
uh, for the recommendations here. So, I mean, let's just give you a quick demo of how we could approach this, build a tailored uh, LinkedIn short form video strategy for me so that I can reach, um, let's just say funded startups for lead generation. And there you go. So, I mean, basically what you're able to do here is work directly from Claude where you're probably spending a lot of time. You can connect the dots and get this closed loop from insight to action. And I think this is extremely powerful. This is why MCP excites me so much. And I think that uh, we're really just kind of scratching the surface with this technology. So. Uh, that's it. Wanted to share this, uh, this alpha with you, and uh, I hope you can uh, give it a try and let me know what you think.